Hello guys, welcome to my apartment tour. And before I show you what my apartment looks like now, I just wanted to show you some pictures of how my apartment looked like on the first day that I moved in here. When we moved in here, the apartment was so dirty. The landlord had some people come in, redo the kitchen cabinets and put in a new sink and fix some wallpaper. So all the floors were just so disgusting. I spent about three days just deep cleaning everything and organizing and unpacking. So this is a two bedroom apartment and the deposit for this was 10 million won and the monthly rental fee is 600,000 won and we also had to sign a two-year contract so yeah it is quite expensive and small but i will show you a video of how my apartment looks like now that everything is finished the top floor of the apartment complex so once i get to my door i don't have any keys i just have the keypad and i just enter my code and it will open and as soon as i close the door it automatically locks or i can manually lock it myself so as soon as we enter the apartment you can see the shoe closet on this side and it is really tall and it has a lot of storage space for my shoes and my husband's shoes and on the bottom I also keep some recycling and we have a drawer for just miscellaneous stuff I just keep shopping bags in there so when we first saw this apartment the kitchen cabinets and everything were really old and the sink was leaking so before we moved into the apartment, we asked the landlady to fix the sink and she put in a new one for us. But she also put in new cabinets and drawers. So I'm really thankful because everything was brand new and looks really nice and pretty. The only thing I don't like about this kitchen is the counters. They're always wet and always look dirty. I don't know what kind of material it is, but water just stays on here. So I have to keep some towels on there or otherwise it'll just be soaking wet. All of the appliances in our apartment, we actually bought from the previous girl living here. Gas stove, the refrigerator, laundry machine, aircon. We got those from the previous owner. On this shelf, I just keep my kitchen appliances and our fridge is quite small, but I think it's good for just me and my husband now. This first room is quite small. I just use it as a bedroom for my dogs and they just sleep in here at nighttime or if I'm going outside somewhere, then they will stay in here during the day. And we also use this as our closet. I bought these curtains and closet poles from Coupon and you can just set them up and they are just great for holding all your clothes. So this is how the closet looks like when the curtains are open. It's a little bit messy. I like having the curtains just to cover everything. And then let's move on to the bathroom. Our bathroom is in the middle and I love this bathroom. It's one of the main reasons why I decided to get this apartment just because it's great and it was brand new. We actually saw an apartment in the same building but that apartment was just so old and I knew like once I saw this bathroom I was like we have to get this apartment because it's gonna be hard to find you know anything this pretty in this building unfortunately this bathroom doesn't have a separate shower so everything in here gets wet but that just makes it easier to clean now we're going into my bedroom slash living room and I was really hoping for a separate living room space but we just kind of have to use it together. 
you can see there's a lot more light once the curtains are open and we have a small terrace here and to go into this terrace you actually have to step down I keep my plants and of course I can do my laundry here and hang them to dry and there's also a huge closet with extra storage space so that's basically my whole apartment it is quite small but it's next to the subway station and it's next to a huge park which is perfect for me and my dogs so thank you for watching my video and I'll see you guys next time bye bye